Kevin Durant was recently interviewed, and he said, yo, despite all the accolades I got, I done did everything that a GOAT is mm-hmm. supposed to do, but I ain't in a GOAT conversation. What's up with that? Mm-hmm. That, was the, that was the gist. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> mm-hmm. So he's just like, you know what I mean? He's feeling the way. So look, despite earning nearly every major award in NBA history and being top 10 all-time in scoring, you know about that, he said, because I went to the Warriors, why should I be in that? Mm. That's the question you should ask. Why not? What haven't I done? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, <laughs> and he had a game win against the Bulls the other night. Ah. So, <laughs> so he said he went in there with that energy. He was like, "Yo, hold on, give me the rock. I'm not the go. We'll pull it from the logo real oh, quick. Give me the ball. Give get me the my, rock. Get to my spot. Boom. That's why they call me a bucket getter. That means get to my spot. That That's was it. already predetermined. That was I'm Look, getting my he spot. Moved. He's get like, to, I'm going right here. Whoop. Left elbow. I work on that all day. All day. Long. So, at the end of the day, when it's all said and done, does KD? deserve to be in the GOAT conversation. Absolutely. Like, I don't, I hate, I hate that shit. Like, I hate the GOAT talk. Like, niggas is nice, bro. Like, this just. This nigga hoops, bro. He got all these awards. Like, he got like, this the and man that. is, like, again, I, he's, he's, he will go down as arguably. Arguably. Arguably, <laughs> Katie. The most. Pure, like the, the, the most pure, purest score that this league has ever seen. That's coming from Melo, B. Like, he is a three. No, nah, he, nah, he's a five-level score. Like, uh, we was breaking the five levels down. Yeah. He's a five-level score. There's no way he can't score at on the court. I seen him pull every type of move you could pull. He's man. a champion. Seven feet Scored, with a bag, bro. He's, but he's seven feet. Yeah, with a you bag. seven feet, champ. You seven feet. He don't seven like feet that. With a bag, you bro, like you that. automatically in the group. He don't like that. He don't like that. He don't like that. <laughs> but he's seven feet. Yeah. Doing, he changed the game. How you not gonna say he's the in the conversation with the GOAT? What is the what is the criteria to being the GOAT? Huh? Is it six rings? If if that's the case, then if if, if we're talking ring culture. Michael Jordan is not the GOAT. True. Bill Russell is. Bill Russell is the GOAT. If yeah. we talking ring culture. Right. But, you but know. People are going to say Michael oh, Jordan is the, the GOAT. Mike. So what is the, you know, what is the criteria <laughs> of the <laughs> GOAT? Like, I the, think the, it was. The, a- the, 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 the geeks and the analytics is, yeah. but when Boom is going to say Bill Russell is the GOAT. Yeah. Like, if you talk to people that was before MJ and like. Oh, yeah. They're going to say, yo, Bill Russell, MJ is not the GOAT. When you talk to your uncles and, 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 and people oh. that was around, they're going to say, Michael Jordan, what? No, Bill Russell. I tell you now, my uncle is so like, So now magic. you ask somebody, they're going to say, Bill Russell? God bless the dead, but they, that's right. how the shit changes. Yeah. So, yes, to answer the question, yeah, that man is in the GOAT talk. He's in the conversation. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> He's in the conversation. No, not even, not even, he is a GOAT. Because it's not just, well, the, it's the way you broke it down, it Michael makes sense. Jordan is a GOAT. LeBron yeah, is a goat. GOAT. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? There can never only be one. Ghost on, you know what I mean? Ghost rolling packs, man. That's a fact. Yeah, nah, that's true. Yo, put Come that on, on the shirt. Ghost. The game is, we already printed up much crazy. Man, the game is about a bucket. Listen, paw on the left. You know what I'm saying? the left. Ghost, ghost rolling only, packs. Listen, Come on, man. man. Stop it. Lions only roll with lions. Come You've on. never seen a lion rolling with anybody, any <laughs> other animal out there. <laughs> <laughs> Shout to Jared Goff, baby. Get it back. <laughs> so yeah, KD is supposed to be in the in the goat talk, and if he not, he 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 a goat. Cause so here's my here's my okay, here's okay. my give me the, give me give me I'm gonna give you the yeah, I'm gonna give you okay. the raw the raw the barbershop take. Everybody thinks, and this is my era too. I've, could we come from the same era? Yeah. Of the Mikes, the Pat Ewings, Peyton and Kemp's, the Malone and Stockton's. Those guys came to that team, stayed with that team, won on that team, retired on that team, won or didn't win on that team, stayed with that team. Mm-hmm. Does, does it make it cheap that he went to the Warriors? You know what I'm saying? Like, yo, y'all was up 3-1. Y'all could beat these guys. It's not like y'all got blown out the gym. You know what I mean? Y'all didn't get swept. Y'all was almost right there. You just blew a lead. Right. But, you know what I mean? The next season, boop, you over there. They just they just smoked you. That's yeah. crazy. Because from my perspective of like as a fan, like as a competitor even, I'm like, bro, if you whooped my ass last year, fuck you. Yeah, but he went there and he did what he had to do. It was times that the Warriors needed him yeah. to come through because they couldn't get to certain spots and they couldn't 
when they really need to slow the game down, they, who they was going to? KD, KD we get to my spot, threes. get to your spot. No, get to your <laughs> spot. Because Steph ain't getting to his spot. Clay ain't getting, they spots is different. KD's spot is one of them four spots. Yeah. I'm going to get there. And we know what's going to happen. So while y'all are chasing Steph and Clay and, and Draymond is backdoor cutting and hitting, you know what I mean, passing and doing what he do, KD is left alone over there. That's crazy. So when you, it's like, oh, shit. Like, I'm going to have open looks? Like, I can play <laughs> this freely? Like, you Yo. know what I mean? Like, oh, I can just, when we need a bucket, I'm going down there. Yeah. Nobody else could go down there. And make that happen. And make that happen. So the dynamic that KD brought to Golden State, they didn't have. So, yes, they had to adapt and adjust to having somebody like KD, but they was going to do what they was going to do. Regardless, that system is that system. They had to figure out how to implement KD into that. So yeah. now you go there and the heat is on you. You win. You win a championship. I mean, yeah, you got it. But so what now about the person that says like, yo, say, it was, yo, you took the easy way out, da 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 da. But you got to understand who is KD, his mindset. I care about basketball and winning. I don't give a fuck about, I, I care about the purity of basketball. I don't care what y'all fans say, and it's no disrespect to y'all, but y'all don't know what's, what I'm going through and yeah. dealing with and thinking about how my approach to the game. So a lot of y'all not going to like this shit, yeah. and I don't care if y'all don't like it. And also, I just won. So what y'all going to say about that? Y'all going <laughs> to hate me for winning? Y'all going to knock my championship? If I lose, I lose. If, if I, I lose, win, I lose? I'm in a lose-lose situation. <laughs> so guess what? I'm going to just focus on what I need to focus on. That's me. And I won. Boy. And I'm going to enjoy this. And fuck y'all. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. He had to, like, even though they already was doing their thing and winning, what he brought to that team and that organization was something totally different. Right? So, and, 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 I'm, and, and this guy is... Arguably the best scorer ever. Arguably. Say arguably, KB, KD. You know what I mean? Arguably. <laughs> arguably. You know what arguably. Saying? arguably, KD. It means it could be arguable. Yeah. You know we My would God. debate on it. But it's, it's <laughs> But you up there. Nah, he's he's yeah, he's there. With that being said, what can you take away from him? The only thing you could take away from him is that he left and went to the op. But if and, and that's uh, the psychological part of that is tough. Yeah. Like, yo, it's like. I mean, it's tough for a fan. I can't imagine. If, I'm going you know to I'm Boston. Saying? Like, yo. Because you got to have. You, I know you. It's like I just go to Boston and I'm like, oh, fuck. I don't give a fuck with that's nobody. That's what I'm saying. I don't give a fuck with nobody. That's saying. what I'm saying. Like, like, if you got. Tra if you if you didn't have a no trade clause and they're like, Melo, we shipping you to Boston. Nah, and you I, go I, there. I would think about it, but I can't at the end of the day. No matter what, what, what that one is. But that, again, that's. I can't project me. Onto him in my situation. I'm just saying him in that situation looked at it like probably like, damn, the we are here. Like we already reached here. These boys is just getting going over here. We got to go through this team every single year. To, I don't know if I, that, that's, ah, I don't, I don't know if we have what we really need to have to go up against them. Yeah, but then you look at the team they had. They was probably missing a, a, a piece or two, two. Yeah. But they was young. So then you leave and you win. So now you now you dealing with the emotional part, you know, and you in your head, and damn, you're not accepting your, you're not accepting your, your, your championship. It's like, damn, man, niggas making me feel like I'm wrong for winning this. So now you start in your own head. You start, that's, you know, I'm not saying he went down there, or maybe he did. I don't know. But you start overthinking, you start, damn, man, like. Playing on your own emotions and replaying it, that's, that shit ain't good for you. So yeah. if he don't go to go to state that year and he stay in OKC, LeBron gets another ring. Maybe two. You get what I'm yeah. saying? It could have went either way. way like it, yeah, it wasn't, yeah. you, you get what I'm saying? Because what KD bought that year, Golden State needed that yeah. to beat. We need a bucket now. We need like we need certain shit that KD yeah. brings to this team in this organ in, in this game in order to beat them boys. Yo, we're taking a brief break from today's episode to let you know that Prize Picks got you covered when it comes to helping you make some real bread. That's absolutely correct, my brother. The NFL playoffs is here now. 
NBA season is in full swing. All stars right around the corner. Prize Picks is helping us cash in. You feel mm, me? Talk you to me. Uh, they got the Daily Fantasy app where you can select two or more players, pick more or less on their projected stats, and turn $25 into $250. And the best part about it is Prize Picks is really simple to play. I can make my picks and submit my entry in less than 60 seconds, bro. Prize Picks allows you to pick a combo projections across football and basketball with specials so you can support all your teams. I still cashing it. Cashing that. You know what I'm saying? I got a couple of projections on deck. A lot of them got to do with the Ravens. You know what I'm saying? So we locked it. Talk <laughs> to me nice. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, be sure to visit, you know what I mean? Prospects.com slash 7 p.m. so they know you're coming from us. Use the promo code 7 p.m. for a deposit match up to $100.